What's going on guys? Welcome to the Xbox 360 2013 Spring Value Bundle Unboxing. This is the previous the Slim model. Uh, there is a new Slim to match the Xbox One, but being that they changed all the ports and actually subtracted features, I decided to get this one for $250. Uh, a good deal, especially since I'm still rocking a 20 gig hard drive and an old core system. Uh, this edition, bundle, whatever you want to call it, comes with two games, Darksiders 2 on disc, which is very nice, in a case, I always like that, and a download voucher for Batman Arkham City, and also comes with one month of Xbox Live Gold. So, let's go ahead and take a look at what is inside. Now I'm sure a lot of you have already seen this and in fact most people who own an Xbox own this one so so first thing you get a headset don't need that I have a Turtle Beach headset which works much better uh, the controller most people have seen that the only difference in this is that the center button the guide button is actually shiny on these new ones rather than the old one has, has like a matte shiny or a matte silver that is. Next up is the still pretty damn big power supply. Smaller than the one I have, but still it's ridiculously big. Look, look I mean just look at it. Um, AV cables for an HD console, still rocking the AV cables. Luckily you can get an HDMI cable for like two bucks on Amazon. Um, okay. Paperwork, no one cares about that. Download voucher for Batman Arkham City. I don't know how big this that game is going to be, though. Um, Darksiders 2 on disc. I actually think this comes with DLC inside the case, too, for the game. Very cool. And a one-month Xbox Live code. Um, on to the actual console. Alright, so now that the console is out of the box, I'm going to show you some of the ports on the back and vents. Um, so, first up we have the power, which is now two-pronged instead of that giant uh, power adapter that had on the old Xbox. Uh, the Pro console, that is. Uh, that is optical audio, HDMI, the proprietary AV, connect, um, LAN, but you don't really need LAN because this has built-in wireless and three USB ports. Also on the top there is the vent, that's the main vent for the console. No vents on the bottom, also there is a vent on each side. Let's take a look at the front. So you can see it's pretty much the same layout as the first console that ever came out for Xbox 360 except these buttons now are now uh, touch sensors. So that is a touch sensor and the power button is a touch sensor. Under this door just like the old console is two USB ports. So now um, I will show you a comparison to the old console. All right, so here it is next, right next to the, my old console. You can see it is a fair bit smaller and it's just less bulky than the old one. Go ahead and take a look at the bottom all the way up. You can see they are pretty much the same layout. Just right at the top, the black one is a little bit shorter. So as you can see, the black one is a little bit longer than the white one. So setting them um, side by side as they would sit under your television set or wherever you would put them, uh, you can see that the new Slim is slightly smaller in most aspects compared to the old one. As I stated in the unboxing part of this video, the controllers are very slightly different. You can see that this is actually shiny and this is actually matte, so that is the only difference in the controllers. I was hoping that on the new one they would have that transforming d-pad but uh, they didn't include that type of controller so it is exactly the same except for that mi very minor detail all right so now we are going to do a sound comparison comparing how loud each console is after about one hour of gameplay all right so this is the old xbox it's been on for about an hour i've been playing uh skyrim and um let's go ahead and take a look at how it sounds So it's fairly loud, and now we're going to take a look at the new one. Alright, so here's the new console. It's been on about an hour. been playing Skyrim. So uh, let's go ahead and see how loud it is. You can see very quiet. You can barely even hear the disc spinning, so definitely a lot quieter. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. Please subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys. 
See you later.